Hi, my name is Brianna Garcia. I'm 21 years old. Today, we'll, I'll be talking about my life from the past, present, and future for the class. And so I want to start as in my diagnosis. I have a disability called spinal muscular atrophy. It's a diagnosis where it deteriorates your muscles and nerves. And, well, I practically... Um, bounds you into a wheelchair for many people and I was diagnosed at age six but I started having the symptoms at age three um, which is like I didn't have any balance and nobody could hug me because then I would fall I started using a walker leg braces and so on I practically lived at the hospital when I was little that's a young age. I even went to Dallas to get several tests done. Um, but now, well, now I'm in a wheelchair and I try to live like a happy life. Mom, many people call me Pinky, Pinky, because ever since I was a baby, my mom would dress me up all in pink. And I guess it just sticked with me because I've always wear pink. Well, I don't always wear pink, right, but I love pink, so I'm wearing it, and my room is pink. Um, I just love pink. Any kind of pink, me wear it's pink. <laughs> and then for my present, I, um, <clears throat> sorry, I, I chose education career for several reasons, but the main reason was because all my squeers, I had a lot of um, issues, which was negligence because of my disability. I didn't know I had many, um, I guess, what are they called? Modifications? Modifications that nobody told me about. And so I had to literally struggle, go through hell just to where I am right now. But I also thank, thanking God and my parents that are always there for me when I need them because I thought that I wouldn't be wouldn't have been able to where I am, where I am right now. Um, I know. So yeah, I chose my this career because I love kids and because I don't want any other student with or without disability to go through what I went through, just for lack of knowledge, I guess. Um, but, yeah, I wish, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I like to do makeup. I didn't do my makeup today. I was too lazy. I mean, I'm just, I was just going to stay home anyways. I also like to do TikToks if you guys want to follow me. I have my name as in Brianna Garcia 915. My occupations are, many people call it knitting. But it's not the same thing as crocheting. Knitting is with two sticks and crocheting is with one. And what I do, I crochet. I do blankets, scarves, beanies, and I sell them. I also know how to knit, but I don't like it. It's harder. And then I also sell Easter eggs. And I make really good money. I make them my own. I paint them, I fill them, and I sell them. And also, something really important that I'm going through right now is I am writing a book about my life. It's practically finished. It's in the process of being edited. So, I see that going into my future of being published. And so many people can can read of what I've gone through ever since I was born. And how I overcome my obstacles and everything. Um, I see myself working at an elementary school near here where I live. I live in El Paso. And hopefully I get to be my nieces and nephews' teachers. Teacher, I mean. That would be a goal of mine. I think I will make a difference in students' lives for the simple fact that um, they'll be able to see my disability and be like, oh, she did it. Um, I know I can too. So, yeah. In conclusion to this video, 
besides everything I've gone through, I stay positive in every perspective. And every perspective, despite my disability, because as I like to say a lot, any day above ground is a good day. And before I end the video, I wanted to show a couple pictures. I know, I, I exceeded a little bit, but I think I'm good. So this is baby me. Well, it's not baby. Not so baby no more. But when I was walking before all my symptoms started. And then I also have a picture of now. Of now. Sorry about that. Of now. This was my birthday. Yeah, it was my birthday. I can see a lot of catfish here. <laughs> Just kidding. And then this is all my family. I'm missing some of my nieces and nephews. But this is a very meaningful picture picture to me that I, always, that I will always cherish. I can't talk right now. Um, but yes, that's how I will end my video today. Um, bye.